Hi, I'm just going to start off by saying an apology about the lack of videos that have been up recently. I'm from me and the rest of the girls. I know that a lot of us have had um, schoolwork on um, and uh, exams coming up, a lot of them do. Um, and we haven't been feeling so great, and also we've had trouble uploading the videos as well. Um, but as soon as they can make a video, then they will do it and it will be up. Um, and today I'm going to do um, the accent challenge. Um, so, yes, uh, here we go. Your name. I'm not going to do my username because uh, this is going to go up. So I don't want yeah, people knowing uh, my personal one. So I'm just going to say my name. Um, my name is Yasmin, or you can call me Yaz. Where you're from? I am from Maidenhead, which is in the UK, near Windsor. Pronounce the following words. Aunt, Reef, Root, Theatre, Iron, Salmon, Caramel, Fire, Water, New Orleans, Pecan, Pecan, Both, Again, Probably, Alabama, Lawyer, Coupon, Mayonnaise, Pajamas, Court, Naturally, Aluminium, Gif, Tumbler, Crackerjack, Doorknob, Envelope, Jipoi? I never actually. I say it in my head and I never know how much I'm supposed to say that. G P O I. I never actually know how to say it. I say it a weird way in my head, but I can't say it out loud. What is it called when you throw toilet paper on a house? I'm not actually sure. We don't really tend to do that in England. As far as I know, if I'm wrong, then let me know. Um, what is a bubbly carbonated drink called? Fizzy drink. What do you call gym shoes? Trainers. What do you call your grandparents? Nan and Grandad. What do you call the wheeled contraption in which you carry groceries at the supermarket? A trolley. What is the thing you change the TV channel with? A remote. Choose a book and read a passage from it. Okay. She's goes page one, that's really easier. Um, okay, I'm going to read uh, the first page of chapter two from The Fault in Our Stars. Chapter two Augustus Waters drove horrifically. Whether stopping or starting, everything happened with a tremendous jolt. I flew against the seatbelt of his Toyota SUV. Each time he braked, and my neck snapped backwards each time he hit the gas. I might have been nervous, what of sitting in the car of a strange boy on the way to his house, keenly aware that my cra crap lungs complicate efforts to fend off unwanted advances. But his driving was so astonishingly poor that I could think of nothing else. We'd gone perhaps a mile in ja jagged silence before Augustus said, I failed the driving test three times. You don't say. He laughed, nodding. Do you do you think you have an accent? Yes, because everyone has an accent. I find it really weird and people not from England who for England who are who or, or who aren't British say, Oh, I love the British accent. It's not really a specific type of British accent. <laughs> we are all different from wherever we come from. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I always find that a bit weird. Um, yes, definitely have an accent compared to my friends up north. And I think actually all of us on my own system visible have completely different accents actually. Because um, we all come from all over the place. So yeah, I definitely have an accent. Um, I get told that I'm quite posh when I talk, even though I don't really get. I don't think that compared to other people I know and then also where I come from isn't really the poshest of places either. <laughs> um, be a wizard or a vampire? Um, I'd say wizard. 
Do you know anyone on Tumblr that in real life? Yes. <laughs> yes, um, I do. I've got... Yeah, two people, as far as I can think, two people that I'm following that follow me. I know. Um, I'm sort of saying on a regular basis. But then I've also got friends who I talk to which, on there which I consider friends. Because I talk to them quite a lot. Um, end audio post by saying any three words you want. Okay, I'm not going to do this because I'm not going to do that one because I'm, I'm going to talk about something else in a minute anyway. So that's my Tumblr, Tumblr accent challenge over. Um, yes, that's exciting. <laughs> um, <coughs> I think some of the other girls are going to um, do one as well at some point, so that would be quite cool to like compare. Um, and I was also going to talk about my weekend. Um, it was my 21st birthday on Sunday. Yay! Not that it's very exciting when we're in England. Um, I can do exactly what I could do when I was 18. Um, apart from going to some different clubs and maybe a strip club. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Um, and... So yeah, on um, Saturday I went to London, and I went to London Aquarium, and I went out for dinner, and the dinner was very, very poor, so I'm not going to go back to that restaurant again, but I don't remember what it's called. It's some sort of Italian near London and London Aquarium. Um, and then Saturday night I was at a party, it wasn't mine, um, it was my boyfriend's sister's one, because it's her birthday, it was her birthday yesterday. Um, so yeah, that was quite good fun. I actually drunk but then um, for some weird reason I didn't actually feel drunk so that was good and I don't have a hangover, hooray even though most days I wake up feeling like I have have woken or I haven't drunk my body's strange um, <laughs> and um, yeah then yesterday I went out for lunch with my mum her boyfriend and my boyfriend um, then just chilled out really and I was quite tired um, from I think it's been going on from work last week so I ended up having a nap <laughs> He was like, so what are you doing on your 21st birthday? Uh, went for lunch, then slept. <laughs> Woo! Living the life. <laughs> um, and then this Friday, I'm doing some more celebrations with friends and family, going out for dinner, um, and then going bowling. So it should be quite good fun. Um, hope you all have a really good week, and I will hopefully see you next week. Bye!